Bush. He just taped his second dry bar special. Make some noise right now for Jeff Shaw, everybody. <laughs> Jeff, and welcome to my gender reveal party. <laughs> Unfortunately, your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> Even my parents hedged their bets. My given name is Jeffrina. <laughs> gender is a touchy topic these days. I ordered a skinny decaf latte with cinnamon, and my barista asked me for my pronoun. I said he, but seeing how I just ordered a skinny decaf latte with cinnamon, I'm pretty sure she is still on the table. <laughs> he said, sir, pronouns are no laughing matter. I said, in that case, my pronoun is yours and my preposition is up. <laughs> Unfortunately, he got that joke and I didn't get my cinnamon. <laughs> For me, being a man means being self-confident, yet not taking yourself too seriously. For example, gentlemen, have you ever been shopping with your lady, then walk up behind her in the store and pinch her playfully on the butt, then realize it's not your lady, but somebody who looks like her from behind? <laughs> Guys, you've got to stop doing that to me. <laughs> without you crab happy hooligans getting my hopes up. <laughs> the more comfortable I become in my own skin, the easier it is for me to have fun during life's awkward little moments. For example, last time I went to Guitar Center, I wound up bumming out this teenager. I said, sorry kid, but I am not Getty Lee from Rush. Oh. <laughs> in hindsight, I probably should have told him that before I signed his bass. <laughs> And believe it or not, telling that kid that I'm not Getty Lee kind of bummed me out too because the only thing worse than being a goofy looking dude with long hair and a high voice is being the wrong goofy looking dude with long hair and a high voice. Are you the bass player from Rush? No, I'm the lead singer from REO Speedwagon. I don't like REO Speedwagon. Well, in that case, I'm Owen Wilson with a nose job. <laughs> It's not easy being a man with a high voice, because although some of you are thinking, come on, Jeff, it's not that high, most of you are thinking, you're a man? Congratulations on your journey of self-discovery. <laughs> a few months ago, a very well-meaning person asked me if I were a transgender woman who had gender reassignment surgery to become a man. I said, no, but if I were, I'd ask for my money back. <laughs> What woman wants to pay to become a man who's less manly than the woman she used to be? <laughs> and although I'm not ashamed of my voice, I have spent my entire life defending my masculinity because of this voice. In grade school, nice voice, Jeffrey, you sound like a sissy. Yeah, well, I'm not a sissy. My daddy says I'm a tomboy. <laughs> And basic training for the army. Nice voice, Private. Why don't you grow a pair? Because, Drill Sergeant, if I had a pair, I'd be in the Marine Corps. Oh. <laughs> Even now, backstage at comedy shows, hey, Jeff, nice tote bag on your shoulder. Is that your purse? No, it's not my purse. It's my genuine leather Harley Davidson motorcycle utility bag I carry my hair care products in. <laughs> Call it a purse one more time, I'll reach in, pull out my detangler brush, and spank you with it. <laughs> it's taken me all these years to realize that it serves me well to be a non-threatening, non-intimidating person. This voice and this demeanor really works good as a comedian because off stage. I can be a smart aleck and get laughs instead of getting punched. <laughs> For example, uh, I was at uh, I was uh, getting a, a, my, my latte and the barista said, can I have your name for the cup? I said, yes, it's Jeff. And she said, is that Jeff with one F or two Fs? I said, two Fs. Good catch. Because <laughs> I'd hate to see what would happen if you only wrote down one F on my cup. Skinny decaf latte for Jeff? Is there a Jeff? Oh, excuse me, miss, are you saying Jeff? <laughs> or are you saying Jeff? Because <laughs> it sounds like you're saying Jeff with one F, not Jeff with two Fs. And I'd hate for there to be multiple Jeffs 
in this establishment, ain't you ordered a skinny decaf latte? She said, is there something wrong with you? I said, that depends. Are you saying you with one you or two you's? 